Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing part two to the bedroom. I am going to go through all of my clothes again because there are still things that I haven't worn and it's been a few weeks since I've done this and I still haven't touched them so there's no reason to keep them hanging around. I'm also going to take care of this nightstand and I'm also going to be going through our entire bathroom because there's tons of products and tons of things in there that I just do not need. I also need to clean my makeup brushes, so I will do that as well. But make sure you guys are subscribed. I'm doing a whole decluttering and minimizing, minimizing, I always feel like I say that wrong, like minimalism journey here on my channel. So if that interests you, make sure you subscribe and let's get started. Stand on. It doesn't really look very pretty, but <laughs> we just have like all of our cords and my extension cord for um, my ring light and like my computer thing and just some little things of my husband's, my extra watch band, some smart plugs, and then in here are all my bathing suits. It does look like a lot here are all my cover-ups and here are my bathing suits. But these are different like pieces that I can mix and match. Um, and we do have a pool and we live in a beach town. So we are constantly at the beach so, and at the pool. So I kept five bathing suits. So most of these two piles I can interchange. This one I'm definitely keeping. I got it last year and I love it. But that one I'm not sure if I will keep. So I'll wait and declutter those and see if I don't need those. And then I put all of my work stuff all in this bottom drawer so now it's off the floor i don't need to worry about it it has a place it has a home and i got rid of everything else this is all stuff to get rid of and then there's a big pile over here of stuff that i got rid of too so it's also a bin under the bed that i'm going to go through that just has random junk in it so 
that is done for now. Next, I'm gonna pull out that bin and then work on the bathroom and then do the clothes. You could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of it. You could be a one of the things I love. Sunday morning breakfast with my bedroom door lock. I like everything that has a cherry on top. Get on my list of the things I love, love, love. You could be the one I trust. All the second chances there are nothing for us. Baby, I will show you how you can catch my vibe And right away I so much time Looping in the blurry lights Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy Cause I got this list of my favorite things You could be the part where it all begins You could be the first and the second and the third and the rest Alright, so I didn't get rid of too much more stuff. Just this shirt, which I always say I'm gonna wear and I never do. This sweatshirt, I got a couple new ones for Christmas and I have like different ones so I don't need this. The sweater, I thought I loved it, but it just doesn't fit right. And then these elf pajamas were our Christmas pajamas and I will not wear them again. They were the most unflattering thing on earth. These shirts I didn't wear. So there's still very little left in my drawers. I did not go through my t-shirt. I'm sorry, my camera battery died. But I was saying that I'm not going to declutter too much of my tank tops and my t-shirts yet because I'm not wearing them. I'm wearing like long sleeve shirts every day. So I don't want to get rid of anything there. So there's not a ton in my drawers, but I got rid of another whole pile and I am going to go through my underwear and sock drawer now because I know there's a ton of stuff in there I can get rid of. I'm not gonna show you any of that because who wants to see someone go through their underwear, but I'm gonna do that now and then we will head over to the bathroom. I'm kind of dreading that because there's so much stuff. So much stuff. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you what I'm working with and then I'm gonna pull everything out and work in my bedroom instead of trying to cram into the tiny bathroom. So that is my plan and let me go get the unmentionable drawer tackled. All right, so now that all that is done, now we are in the bathroom. This needs to be gone through, and then let me flip you around and show you all of this. I got ready today and I didn't bother putting anything back because I knew I was gonna be pulling everything out, so this is, there's such, such old nail polish in here, like, look at that. I never paint my nails, so, most of these, like these ones, are my daughter's, so I'll keep these for her. But other than that, those all need to go. And then below here is just a bunch of more makeup and hair stuff and just stuff that I really don't need. So I'm going to pull all of this out, put it on the floor out here. I have that basket that I'm going to use for like things that I can give away to friends and family and then I have a trash bag on the other side. So let's pull everything out and then get to decluttering. is a lot of stuff to have in a small little bathroom so that bag is trash these are two other bags of stuff that I went through that I'm giving away and donating one's a whole bag of shoes and the other one's a bag of clothes so I'll just add anything that needs to be thrown out to this bag right here Never could it bite, but somehow you make me 
Now I have all of my hair stuff in there. I got rid of a ton of brushes and a ton of stuff. So I just have like my hairspray, dry shampoo, and uh, like thing I spray on my hair after I get a shower, like curl stuff. And then my straightener, blow dryer, and curling iron. And then that is all of my makeup. That's everything I got rid of that like pink thing that you guys saw. I used to have all of my makeup in there and I thought that was downsizing. But I put everything I use on a daily basis in there and then said, okay, if I don't need anything else, this is what I'll use. I could probably actually go through that and there's probably some things in there I don't use. But in the back is all of the nail polishes and all like nail polish, um, not nail polish, um, like nail clippers and cuticle clippers and things like that. And then in here, I just have makeup that I have purchased, like extra mascaras and foundations and powders and things like that. And then in the back is like face masks and things like that that I've been given. These are things that are open um, that I am will need to work on first for opening anything else. It's just some feminine products down there. These are what I use for my face, like reusable makeup wipes. Um, I have some sunless tanner some stuff for my hair. If this goes in with that, it spills, so I just keep it in here. In that little Sephora bag is all of my hair elastics and extra things like that, and then I have a dry brush, and that's it. That is all of my stuff. I just need to neaten up this little shelf, but this is just like my toner, my face wash, and things like that, like that little purple one is gone and things like that. So I do need to neaten that up, but nothing will be needing to be decluttered. And then once these are gone, I was given this as a gift and I love it. But once those pads are gone, I am going to purchase reusable pads and then have my face wipe face cloth in there along with the reusable pads. So look at what look at everything I was able to get rid of. This is all trash and that is donate. So this is all like makeup that I can't use. There's nothing in there that I didn't have any extra stuff that I was able to give except that is my jewelry cleaner. I need to pick up that before I forget. But all of this is underwear that couldn't be donated. It's just things that nobody else would want so that this whole pile here is trash, and then these two are giveaway. So, not bad for round two. And don't forget, I have two huge bins of clothes upstairs, which will be decluttered soon too. So, I'm not gonna touch those until I take down my summer stuff because it's all mixed up, so I will deal with that then, but I'm good. I feel like that is a lot of stuff after 
I'm sure you guys saw part one, I'll have it linked below, but I got rid of a ton of stuff in the first video as well. So I was able to get a lot done and I feel very accomplished, except for having to find places for that stuff. But thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss any future videos and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.